House help steals money from Davido's, um, is it baby mama now? Baby yeah, mama. Um, Sophia Momodu. And I think this, this happened earlier in the year. Mm -hmm. And they also made away with Imadi's passport. But um, it's over now. But she decided to come out to share the story. Mm. I don't know, but I feel like people need to be more careful with um, the kind of people they bring into their house. According to her, she had no idea that this had happened mm. until the older oh, yeah. nanny called her attention <laughs> to it and then she checked and found out. But yeah, we need to be more careful. I think we've, we've said this on the show CCTV, several times. CCTV, yeah. CCTV and always watch it. Mm -hmm. That's just it. Be careful what you bring into your home. And I mean, if you have children at home, keep the CCTV camera on mm -hmm. and always watch it. You need to be extra careful. But what would you be doing with somebody else's international passport though? Maybe the person, <laughs> the girl is probably an illiterate and she mm. felt maybe I can travel with it. Wow. You never can tell. She stole some money too. Mm. <laughs> so she can be a nice ticket. Well, we're talking about the <laughs> David O's daughter. Mm. Well, let's say happy birthday to David O. He's, oh, he turns, yeah. He turns 27 today. today. Happy, happy birthday. Bye-bye. I'm, I'm just wondering <laughs> why, why, why is this story we're surfacing? It happened earlier on in the, in the, in the in Because the year. she's sharing I mean, it now. It's David O's birthday today. Mm. Can Sophie and Momodo just chill? The, the shine, the focus should be on on David Doe, I'm just trying to look at it from another angle. Mm -hmm. Why is she bringing all of this all of a sudden? It's David Doe's birthday. Let's let him enjoy his day. Mm -hmm. All right. Um, for me, it's just a moral of a story right here. Uh, I like the fact that these days, before you can get a house up, there's some there's some agents agency that exists right now for mm -hmm. you to get your nanny, your house up from, and they they spare you the the rigorous stress of finding out who they are, where they're from. They do all of those due diligence mm -hmm. as far as they go to their background, check the family are from. Uh, so if people are looking for people to come be house help for them, nannies for them, you can go through some of these agents. You don't have to. I think it's in the quest if you're trying to say, okay, I need somebody for my village, mm. somebody I know. Well, sometimes people from these um, agencies to are terrible people. No, but, terrible people. But you know, you know, you know, the good thing about that is that you have somebody to hold accountable if I anything think goes wrong. The is done. You know, no. You I, I mean, I understand having a middleman you know, stand yeah. as an agency, agency and all that, mm. but I'm saying they don't do their job. They don't. So we are actually in a very difficult situation here, and um, it's just between you and your God. Which is why I tell people that you see in Nigeria, you can't tell people to stop praying. I'm telling you. Because at the end of the day, that's only, God, God, that's God, only you. person you can fall back uh -huh. to, right? Have your, have your spy cam at home. Yeah, so you, you just, just do everything home, and put so, everything in place. I'm happy for Momodo, for Sophia Momodo, and mm -hmm. I hope she's learned a lesson. And so next time, before you let anybody into she your has, house, she has. Mm -hmm. you want to do your due diligence. I think due diligence, we don't. Don't just bring a total stranger into your house because somebody tells you, okay, she's good at keeping the house clean and taking mm -hmm. care of babies. And we've seen cases where people who are good at taking care of babies where the one molesting the babies mm -hmm. and even True. almost killing the babies. So do all you need to do to protect your world, to protect your family. The times are very cold. Yeah. Mm. People are mean. 